Hi everybody, Jo here again. Thanks so much for popping in. Now, I've got a lovely quick Christmas card for you. Look at this. And you know what the best bit is? It's using one of our scenescapes. Look at this. And this one is called Snowy Silence. And it's perfect when you need a quick card. You have to excuse the, the glare. They're quite shiny, so it just reflects a bit with my light. But our new stamps, oh look, envelope as well. And I forgot to show you back of the card. Oh, coordinates beautifully. But you can do it really, really quickly. So if you need a Christmas card and you haven't got one made and you need to sneak into your craft room, we're going to use Versafine Claire and it's the pine cone, lovely brown. And the stamp is our fabulous new Christmas joy. Gorgeous tree, this. And all I'm going to do is just look for a space here where I think I can plant him. Straight down. Give him a good press. Let that ink soak in. And the good thing is, like I say, background's already done. And there's nothing wrong with this. When you haven't got time to make your own background, I love making my own backgrounds, as you know. But sometimes, you know, might have run out of time. Look at that. And we're going to come in at the top with this lovely fairy catkins. I adore this stamp. We're going to keep the same brown and we'll just put some lovely, let's angle it that way. And then I think we'll have another one there. Then maybe just one more. I'm thinking coming in there and we've got some lovely words and I've gone for the Noel and these are the seasonal words and what I'm thinking is this space here look is perfect Noel's just gonna fit in beautifully now some color but again we haven't got long so Posca a white and a yellow and I'm just going to do a bit of a cheat. So I'm going to add the white tip first, just on the end of my catkins. And I'm adding the white first. I know you're going to ask me, because if I add the yellow first, I don't want to get yellow Posca on my white pen. And I'm doing it upside down just because it's easier for me to see where exactly the catkins are. And then what I'm going to do is come in with the yellow and then almost blend it into the white. And I don't mind getting white on the end of my yellow Posca. Prefer it that way than the other way. And I'm just going to colour those in. And this will be permanent when it's dry. Goes onto the um, scenescapes beautifully. And it's so effective. There we go. Look at that. Really does pop, doesn't it? And what we'll do is we'll do some of our... There we go. We're going to have a little dot at the top and some of these gorgeous circles here. Just random. We we'll like a bit of random. And then come in with the white. Again, give it a good shake. And we'll just... And I'm just keeping it to the two colours. Again, you can add more colours if you want. But I'm going for, we need a Christmas card and we need it quite quickly. And again, if you haven't got a lot of products, if you've only got these two. And then what we're going to do to finish it off, a little bit of snow under there. Look, we've got the shadow, but look, if we add a bit more snow... And then what looks lovely is on Noel. I just pop it round, look, and I'm going to add a little bit of snow. And I'm doing this upside down just because it's the way I work. And I love that. Then another shake. And we'll add a little bit more snow. Oh, lovely. Over the catkins. Over the tree. 
we've already got the orbs there so we don't need a lot just a little bit of snow and there we go now you could do two or three threes at once if you wanted and then you'd have them ready to just pop on a, a dl or a slimline card blank look at that how quick was that and so effective see nobody would ever know you'd used a scenescape so shh if you get one of these don't tell anyone that i cheated well it's not a cheat is it it's using what's available I have to say new stamps just love them Anyway, I've just popped in for a quick five minutes. Mason, what you can do, isn't it? You take care. Thanks for popping in. Love and hugs from me. Bye for now.